The Auburn School District created this guide for teachers to help them create a more equitable learning environment for students in the classroom and in any school setting, really. So a lot of professional development and training actually focuses on seven principles here at the bottom that allow students to be themselves culturally and to be their authentic selves in the classroom. So another way uh, that the school district is encouraging students to be more comfortable is with something called the YES program. So this stands for Youth equity stewardship and all four Auburn high schools are involved. Students are able to come together as a diverse group to have sometimes difficult discussions about race, diversity and solutions for schools. So according to Washington State's Office of Superintendent of Public Instruction, black students make up just 8.2% of all Auburn students, yet they also make up 18.5% of all suspensions and expulsions. The rate is also disproportionate for students of two or more races. But Auburn students say the YES program is making impactful change. Some of the students in the classrooms are applying what we've learned, like be more, be more confident in who we are, um, trying new ideas out of our comfort zone to help our community or either our school. We want their voice to help us to change some of the systems, some of the policies, uh, and also some of the things that are, uh, you know, the structural things that are going on in our schools. So the YES program is also being implemented at the elementary school level, and they are looking to launch it in the middle schools as well. But if you're interested in learning more about what the Auburn School District is doing to work towards a more equitable system, all you have to do is text the word equity to the number on your screen, 206-448-4545, and we will send you a link. From Auburn, I'm Kiara L. Fallen, King 5 News.